three women who were abducted as teenagers have been found alive in a house in Ohio. Charles Ramsey, a neighbour of the house where the women were being held, says he heard screams and went to help. I hear the screaming. So I, I, I see one of my neighbours across the street leave his house and run toward my house. But he doesn't come to my house. He goes next door. So I go to the door to see what he's looking at. And this girl is hit, kicking the door and screaming. So I go over there with my Big Mac, and I say, well, can I help you? What's going on? She says, I've been kidnapped, and I've been in this house a long time. I want to leave right now. All right. So I opened the door, and we couldn't get in that way. So we kicked the bottom of it, and she came through. And when she came, I thought she was the only one. And she grabbed some little girl and had the little girl in her arm. She said, this is his daughter. Now, it didn't dawn on me who his was. I didn't know we were talking about him, my neighbor. I thought she meant another dude. And so this young lady identified herself as, as a your... man of bear. And she said, this is his child. And that girl's about 9, 10 years old. You know what I mean? And what about Gina De Jesus? And she was up there, too. Now, she didn't come out with Amanda. The police went in the house and, and, and got them. Amanda Berry disappeared in 2003 when she was just 16. Gina De Jesus went missing a year later at the age of 14. And Michelle Knight vanished in 2002 at the age of 20. All three women are now in hospital. Good evening. Um, just to give you a brief update. Currently, they're safe. We're in the process of evaluating their medical needs. Um, they appear to be in fair condition at the moment. Police say three men, believed to be brothers, have now been arrested over the kidnapping.